Good evening, everybody. Hi. Nice to see you all again. This is Gaetano Conti from Solid Steel for having this new live box uh, meeting on Facebook and uh, YouTube channel. Uh, I'm glad of sharing with you tonight some uh, interesting details about uh, um, our Hyperspike HF series, which is uh, absolutely our top range. Uh, so I welcome you for joining uh, the event and the live box session. Uh, tonight, uh, I will spend with you some time uh, giving uh, attention to um, probably our flagship, our RAC uh, uh, flagship, which is uh, historically known as uh, HF Hyperspike Original Hyperspike Series. So uh, I anticipate you a little content of what we will check tonight. So we will speak about these uh, fantastic spikes and uh, how they work on our racks and why we designed them, why we uh, manufactured them. And uh, hi, hello Alessandro, hi Fred Agostini. And why we decided to craft this uh, high piece of uh, Italian engineering that made us uh, known in the world and in the audio, I am the audio industry all over the world. So uh, what I will do tonight is to explain how the HF series works, why we decided to make the hyperspike range, who designed it, and uh, why it is so important today to think about um, a, a good IAN rack for an IAN system, audio video system. So, first of all, uh... <laughs> thanks, thanks, Alessandro. Uh, you, you are always attending, always uh, following uh, our live sessions, and uh, I'm so happy for this. Uh, can't wait to see you again in Rome. Uh, I know that you're about to make a fantastic new showroom and place uh, in our Italian capital. So can't wait to meet you again, Hackathon. So um, how, 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 how we designed the upper spike range? The upper spike range uh, started to be considered and uh, approached in 2004. 2004, my father, Moreno Conti, uh, who is also our solid steel founder, uh, thought that a modular concept of uh, building uh, and configuring racks um, would have been the best choice for every audio passionate in the world. Best choice because uh, having uh, the possibility of using a modular configuration uh, allowed and allows nowadays um, to our uh, audio passionates to use uh, um, a rack, a table, a, a stand, which is uh, uh, configurable in different ways. This means having uh, multiple levels and shelves having different lengths between every uh, space uh, on the units and uh, having uh, all of sorts of pieces that assembled once assembled together may give uh, the possibility of uh, uh, building uh, the, the best rack uh, for a certain audio system so my father at that time was uh, uh, mostly, and so it still was mostly crafting racks uh, as uh, a, a, a wall, a wall unit, a wall frame with welded parts. So it was all a piece, uh, a, a block, no, a metal block welded without any uh, chance of possibility of being uh, modified after the the craft. So uh, he thought, why don't we make uh, a piece of extremely high-end furniture 
for those who are very exigent, for those music lovers who really want the best for their audio equipments and components. So he started, uh, thanks also to our uh, current supplier, to develop and to study, to make research on materials, on pieces, on uh, configurations. And uh, it came out that um, during uh, uh, two years of hard work, uh, the, the, the spike, no? as we can see here on our website, the spike uh, made in stainless steel inox uh, in high quality, very heavy stainless steel uh, gave the best performances, the best efficient in dampening vibrations. So it came out a system by which uh, my father designed uh, different poles lengths for giving uh, uh, multiple uh, choices for configuring different kind of uh, uh, spaces and the stands. And uh, it came out the HS series. The HS series was the uh, first hyperspec series ever launched. Uh, it is currently available on our catalog, but it has a three pillar configuration hardware. So the frame is made with three pillar and the HF, which is hyperspike four, uh, has made as a natural evolution uh, during the years. So officially the hyperspike range, the traditional hyperspike uh, was launched in 2006. Uh, it, it has been uh, a huge, huge, huge uh, upgrade on our catalog because from that point on, uh, we, we had the possibility of offering to our um, customers and music lovers two different ranges of racks. One as reference, which is now our current as series, as you can see from our website. And now, uh, and sorry, and uh, uh, as well, the upper spec range, which is designed for the high hand stuff, equipments. And uh, we will see now uh, during this uh, uh, short uh, uh, journey, uh, during this short uh, live session, uh, which are the benefits of having an upper spec rack. So uh, as you can see from this uh, little window, we have here our uh, website. So. I kindly invite you to visit the website for discovering more. And uh, uh, you can follow me now in the discovering of the Hyperspike HF series. So here there's our Hyperspike catalog and you can absolutely discover all our Hyperspike stands and racks. But I kindly invite you one when you have time to select the HF range in order to explore and uh, discover more of this fantastic uh, original series. So I open now the HF4 rack, which is uh, one of the most, most famous uh, HF racks uh, in the world. And this is as you can see from uh, this uh, page, um, the traditional configuration of, uh, uh, of uh, the HF series. We have four shelves and uh, everything is made in two um, different ways. We have the stainless steel, which is the frame, uh, it is part of the frame from the top to the bottom parts. And we have wood for the shelves. Wood is MDF ennobled wood with the carb two um, com com uh, com compliance. So we have uh, uh, materials which are made in deep respect of all the formal dyed. Uh, um, laws, international laws, no, for protecting the the health, people's health. So uh, these uh, finishes in wood are lacquered. So and we have a flat black finish, which is the the huge rack here on the on main on main display. We have the gloss black finish and the gloss white finish. These three finishes have been the first to be uh, included on our catalog because in our philosophy, we always wanted to give um, 
a very clean uh, and uh, simple design to our products in order to let them being uh, uh, displayable and uh, usable and uh, choosable for every kind of uh, music room and uh, home environment. So uh, we are very happy because uh, there are some countries in the world in which uh, the HF series is most known in white finish, like in the UK, for example, like in the uh, in, like in France, in North European, Russia. And there are uh, some other places in which, uh, for example, in the United States, in Hong Kong, China, in um, Singapore, where the flat black and the gloss black finish is uh, uh, preferred. I, perf I personally love the gloss black finish because the gloss black is a kind of fantastic uh, lacquer with a, a gloss transparent on top, which is... Uh, incredible it's uh, it's uh, fantastic and uh, i invite you to discover more about that and uh, what's special about uh, the hf series first of all its structure its frame because uh, we are talking about heavy solid steel full inside so the machineries are um, the, numeric, the numeric control machineries are crafting every single piece from the from the full of the stainless steel bars and uh, with a little brush treatment we uh, make them uh, being very bright so you will have a lot of uh, light in your uh, in your uh, music room uh, adding a piece uh, adding a piece of iron furniture which is uh, the original one but um incomparable so uh, the HF4 is very heavy, so we are talking about 66 kilos, but we will um, discover more details uh, in a few seconds. So as you can see here, during last uh, year, we uh, also added three new finishes, which are the HF in uh, uh, walnut, uh, uh, na American natural walnut finish, which is beautiful because it is timber and it is veneer wood. So we are using uh, real veneer wood applied on uh, 30 millimeters of uh, uh, MDF wood. And we have here rosewood finish, which is amazing. And uh, uh, the uh, Indonesian Makassar ebony uh, finish, which is also completed with a gloss transparent for giving an extra luxury effect. Um, you will see many materials and videos on our website about this beautiful finish, and I will show you uh, later what I mean. Um, when you have time, please check also the details below, because by these uh, technical specifications, you can uh, discover all uh, the uh, most important information about these stands. So, for example, Every shelf is able of uh, supporting 80 kilos uh, tested per each shelf. So an HF4 can uh, support more than 200 kilos, let's say 240 kilos for sure tested. And uh, um, you, you can absolutely load huge uh, monoblock power amp or stereo amplifiers on the bottom shelf, we, be, because the bottom shelf, as you will see now, are a bit uh, wider and larger, or sorry, larger. Uh, and um, you can modify essentially whatever you want, because uh, of course, I said before that we have three, uh, five, uh, six solutions for colors, but what is really uh, important is the outer dimension of a stand. So the HF4 has shelves of 645 millimeters of width and uh, 561 millimeters of depth. This means that by watching their photos, the shelves are with a, an irregular shape. So uh, once uh, you are placing your audio system on each shelf, your component will look beautiful because having a, a not regular 
um, base uh, for your uh, stuff with your equipment is giving uh, you a modern feeling a modern touch an high level of design which is unique so uh, we can we can say that if you go uh, on the technical drawing with me uh, you can notice that we have 175 millimeters from the bottom to the first shelf and uh, this is very important because uh, if you have uh, for example uh, some uh, some some equipment for power suppliers no you you can stock uh, on the on the um, below side on the first level of the rack uh, right here below the first shelf and uh, uh, here you, we have uh, the traditional hyper spike the traditional hyper spike as uh, we can see is exactly this one and it is very easy to regulate because uh, if you follow my uh, my my cursor here you can see that the upper spike can be regulated so once you unlock this ring and uh, by unlocking this ring it's very easy because you can do it with your hands you can see that by re regulating the height of the spike and locking it again there's a safe way of uh, leveling up your wall stand for the best dampening of vibrations. Once you do this on all of the four spikes, on all of the four hyper spikes, you can have the perfect leveling and the perfect equilibrium of the wall unit. So in that moment, when there's no traveling, no shakes, where there are no shakes, in this moment, the rack is working perfectly for your needs and your audio system is able of being valorized uh, at, at uh, its best. So as you can see here, there's full stainless steel. I want to show you how these spikes are made because we have O-rings, rubber O-rings uh, on, um, on these parts, on the ring and on the spike for dampening vibrations and for discharging for cutting off uh, some uh, bad frequencies, uh, bad resonance that may cause uh, uh, negative audio experiences. But look uh, how uh, sharp and uh, clean it's the finish and uh, the craft, the crafting of, uh, of this part of this piece. Here you have, uh, look at this, how beautiful it is. And so, this comes always already assembled. So as you can see, there's a beautiful way of of installing your rack. So once you have, uh, when, when you purchase the product, it comes already in this configuration. So no, no worries if you are not so pra practical with the uh, manual uh, installations, do not worry. They are already prepared for uh, being installed. But I just wanted to show you how each part is uh, carefully uh, crafted and uh, prepared and manufactured. So these spikes, are on the bottom of the rack. So I go back to the technical drawing. And uh, uh, hello, Andy. Uh, thanks for the beautiful words. Uh, you, Andy knows very well our uh, products uh, because he's our UK distributor. So uh, he's from Mian Audio Distribution. And uh, I, I will I will show you later our partners list all over the world. And if you have any request uh, for the UK, you can count on me and audio distribution. A uh, big hello to Andy and to Mick and to all the guys there. Um, I just want to go back to the uh, HF4 web page, by which you can see that uh, on the first level we have 
875 millimeters from the floor to the first shelf. The first shelf has 30 millimeters of depth. So on that shelf, we usually suggest to put your heaviest, 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 heaviest stuff, including um, integrated uh, amplifiers or stereo power amps, or why not mono blocks if you have them, but I suggest to use uh, a power amp stands for uh, high end uh, mono or stereo um, mono blocks. However, uh, if you if you notice um, the difference between uh, the shelves are basically um, made on the on the on the levels. So we have uh, here. 305 millimeters for the first level of the rack, uh, which is uh, in its standard configuration, the larger space we have on the HF uh, four, for example. And we have on the second shelf, between the second and the third shelf, so on the, so on the second level, 205 millimeters, which are 8.1 inch for the US people. In these kind of uh, um, upper spaces, as you can see, I usually suggest to uh, collocate uh, CD players, if you have DAC uh, or streamers, or if you have uh, a phono preamp, because uh, if you have uh, um, a turntable, so both an analog and uh, digital, uh, stereo Wi-Fi equipment, IAND equipment, I'd suggest you to place the turntable on top for obvious reasons. The uh, pre pre phono preamp uh, on the uh, third level, or differently, if you have uh, an integrated amplifier which has uh, a phono stage uh, included as integrated stage. Uh, I would ask uh, you, why don't you adopt this third level for your CD uh, player or for your streamer or for your DAC uh, equipment? This could be a good choice. Uh, as, you, as you can imagine, there are many, many, many multiple uh, configurations available for these racks. You can also, um, for instance, put uh, two of them together. And uh, yes, they are quite expensive. Uh, the retail price list uh, of this rack uh, is very, very expensive, but it is depending on the fact that for crafting, for making uh, uh, this uh, high-end piece of furniture, uh, we are using uh, high-quality Italian materials, full stainless steel, lacquered shelves in wood, uh, or moreover, more than this, uh, banner wood. So all expensive stuff. The packaging is uh, uh, well uh, designed. So uh, first of all, the safety uh, of who is assembling the rack is the first step because there are many spikes. So uh, keep children uh, away from the rack when installing it because the spikes are very sharp. So if you know uh, how to, if you are studying or are getting to uh, the idea of uh, upgrading your audio system and for dedicating enough space uh, in, uh, in uh, your uh, music room, uh, I think that with the HF series, you can go uh, on a um, on a safe uh, on a safe purchase because uh, the benefits are uh, first of all uh, a clearer and more transparent sound because uh, the upper spike spikes and the wall frame and also the wooden shelves are able of discharging to the ground all the bad frequencies that may cause resonance and these bad frequencies. Uh, are simply generated uh, both from your components. Think about, for example, a turntable who is rotating now when playing, or from your digital and uh, amplification uh, equipments. So um, imagine when you're playing music, uh, all the audio frequencies are uh, rolling and spreading all over the music uh, room, all over the, the space. 
And um, all these frequencies are going to be reflected on your table, stand, and rack as well. And it happens that if the surface is not able of discharging to the ground all these huge amount of uh, vibrations, then uh, what is on top of uh, your shelves of uh, your furniture will be uh, negatively affected. So the benefits are absolutely multiple and uh, be sure that uh, with our products, uh, you can have, you can optimize, you can improve, you can add uh, uh, more class, more design, but more efficiency to uh, your wall setup. And um, an another benefit is that um, you if you purchase an HF series rack or one of our hyperspec racks, uh, you are purchasing the best we can make. So it could be, or well, it is, it will be, it is effectively, uh, a reference point on your setup. So maybe you can change a turntable, maybe you can change an amplifier, a CD player, or, or cable or speakers. But once you purchase a, an hyperspec rack, you will not move it. <laughs> so uh, this, is, uh, this is true because uh, uh, we are, we are uh, making these uh, stands uh, almost from 15 years and uh, they gave us the possibility of uh, growing a lot. So um, during uh, all these uh, decades of work, uh, we discovered what to do for valorizing uh, uh, our um, customers' uh, equipments at their best. And uh, I, I agree also with Jay, uh, a big hello to Jay also, who is always following us, um, who is supporting quality costs money. Yes. Uh, in general, tendentially, it's like this. Not always, uh, not always true, but uh, we are very focused on that because, uh, first of all, uh, we make products um, always having care of the customers. So this means that, first of all, we we prepare goods, we make goods, we manufacture products and stands uh, and offer services. Like uh, uh, if uh, all of these uh, will be uh, destined to ourselves. So uh, I, I imagine that if uh, somebody is uh, giving uh, trust uh, on us, if uh, an audio lover is uh, spending a lot of money on our products, on our services, uh, on what we do, uh, we have to offer only the best. And uh, the best, it means uh, a very hard and uh, um, ca um, careful selection of materials because uh, uh, we check uh, all the parts uh, before uh, assembling a product. And uh, we always uh, offer the, um, the care, the needed care for preparing each part screwing everything, testing that everything is correctly working because uh, when we ship uh, products uh, to Italy and outside of Italy, we want to stay safe because uh, uh, there's nothing more important than having satisfaction uh, when somebody knows that he's uh, spending a lot of money, but when money is well worth, this is uh, extremely uh, important for us. Uh, I, I want to say hi, Fabio, my dear friend. Uh, Fabio, would like to meet you so much uh, in the next uh, weeks uh, when possible. I hope you are good. Thanks also for supporting us. Uh, so uh, I go back to the HF series because uh, I want to, to give you um, some uh, some. Uh, uh, tips and some suggestions uh, by checking our gallery on our website for showing you how the HF can be uh, chosen for your music uh, room. So uh, come with me. Oh, you can see, uh, let's make uh, some, uh, <laughs> some, brand, uh, some, some brand view because uh, I, I wanted to, to show you this beautiful photo that has been taken with Yamaha. Well, this picture is huge, very huge. And here you can see, this is uh, 
eh, Lorenzo, Jorge Lorenzo's uh, motorbike in 2017, and we made a beautiful event with Yamaha in Milan at, the, uh, at their warehouse. Uh, and uh, yes, we, we used an HF3 in flat black finish, as you can see from, uh, from here. And uh, yes, uh, it has been a beautiful uh, configuration and uh, check our gallery for discovering more. But before that, I, um, I would like to show you um, something about uh, uh, the upper spec range. So we have the HF uh, range here on display with Mofai. Mofai is our US distributor. They are uh, spectacular guys, and this picture has been taken during uh, uh, the CES uh, um, show in Las Vegas in 2016. I was attending the show personally and uh, couldn't uh, um, renounce to taking uh, <laughs> to take this beautiful picture. So uh, also here we have something. Luxity is a Danish brand which is making. Uh, uh, electronics, uh, uh, I suggest you to check it out. Uh, yes, Nguyen Audio is our uh, partner in Vietnam. And uh, okay, this is another HF with Yamaha components. This is the previous picture. And I wanted to show you one of my favorite photos, which is, uh, no, we have many of them. This is the, the this is the HW HW white. Uh, this is the chess. Look at how beautiful is this configuration. If I'm not wrong, this is uh, uh, in uh, Belgium or in Netherlands. If I, if if it is uh, uh, not in ba in Netherlands, it is in Belgium. Uh, but uh, Look uh, how uh, nice is uh, this uh, white uh, rack, HF white, it, it has uh, white series, it has string white, gloss white finish. So, uh, oh, a nice turntable. I wanted to show you, yes, this is the uh, HP series in France, in Paris. Uh, this is also the HP series in Munich years ago this is the hj series and i wanted to show you well this is the hf3 in gloss black finish with v2 audio i and components uh, it's extremely beautiful. The, the gloss uh, of the shelves is like uh, uh, a piano. So if uh, you love uh, this effect, well, there could be some dust on top because uh, when you are using some uh, gloss transparent like red shelves, you have to be uh, more careful for taking care of the surface and uh, you know, the, the, cle the cleaning of the shelves may be uh, more stressing, but believe me that the, um, the final effect is uh, fantastic. So uh, I just want to give you uh, the possibility of exploring uh, all our other galleries. So here we have an HF5 in gloss black. This is a, a fantastic picture taken in the US. Uh, if I'm not wrong, it is a, a Magnolia Experience Center, AV Experience Center. And uh, well, these uh, units do not need any presentation because we have uh, a Bowers and Wilkins 801 speakers and fabulous McIntosh amplifiers, both uh, in monoblocks. Power amps. Uh, Jay is saying HP for the natural traverting is your dream. Well, uh, <laughs> I agree with you. I agree with you. Uh, natural traverting is a, a finish which uh, is more beautiful 
uh, when uh, um, when you can touch it and experience it and you can see it personally because uh, i tried many times to take some decent beautiful photos but there's nothing absolutely nothing uh, more beautiful than watching the uh, the rack uh, with your eyes uh, it's not easy because uh, it's a, a, a very it's it's an extremely luxurious rack uh, um very hard to find uh, somewhere but we always have it on stock jay so we do we will uh, we will always do our best for treating you right by the way um yes um this this is a setup uh, which is extremely popular in the us because uh, uh, we constantly receive uh, many requests during the weeks uh, um asking for how to 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 purchase the hf series for having a macintosh or a, a other heavy iron stuff uh, on our stands so this is a, a picture from uh, iFi D'Agostini. Uh, Alessandro is uh, one of our best Italian dealers. iFi D'Agostini is in Rome, and uh, this is is uh, this is their uh, display in their uh, showroom. And uh, in this picture, there's an HS4. HS, I uh, remember you. It is with three pillar, uh, and the HF is with four pillars. We are uh, not far from the conclusion of this life box. Uh, oh, look at that. Uh, here uh, also there's uh, the huge uh, help and the huge display of First Impression Marketing Limited, which is our historical distributor for Hong Kong and China, which is uh, representing uh, fantastic brands like uh, Audio Flight, which is uh, a, an Italian brand uh, uh, manufacturer of uh, uh, electronics amplifiers, uh, all made in Italy. I'd suggest you to take a look for these. And they also represent uh, Cardas Audio, Audio for cables, Jeff Rowland, uh, Kiseki for turntables and cartridge. Also, they have music tools, which is uh, our um, historical competitor in Italy. Uh, they are very good guys. Uh, uh, they they make uh, different tracks from ours, but uh, we respect them a lot. And they have Avalon, and uh, if I'm not wrong, they are currently also uh, representing Prima Luna, which uh, make uh, uh, available two tube amplifiers, amazing tube amplifiers. So on this display you can see um, three HF3 in gloss black uh, all together, uh, supporting a fantastic IAND audio system. This is an HW. And uh, yes, who uh, is recognizing this fantastic component? I, I give you some seconds for replying. Uh, this is uh, probably one of the most desired uh, brands with uh, with others of course that are on market uh, but uh, the, this huge amplifier is fantastic uh, i had the possibility of listening uh, to the to the demonstration they had uh, in munich uh, last year and uh, they were fantastic but okay i tell to you what component is that? Oh, Super J. <laughs> yes, then D'Agostino. D'Agostino uh, on top of this fantastic HF4 in a gloss black finish. And uh, yes, this is the kind of high end equipment that is able of being supported by our HF uh, stands. Um, I. Yes, look at that at this beautiful setup with Avalon. Again, our uh, Hong Kong and China distributor, FIM, First Impression Marketing Limited, uh, had a show in China, if I'm not wrong, and they displayed uh, this fantastic uh, uh, equipment with a beautiful, beautiful sound. Um, before, oh yes, this is... Uh, the gallery okay here again we have a partnership with the yamaha 
and uh, this was uh, a, a display, an upper spike display we had in Rimini two years ago. Uh, let, let's see if there's something else. Okay, before we go, I want to show you uh, some more details about our current uh, catalog because uh, as I told you before, uh, we are celebrating our 13th brand anniversary. Uh, and we decided to make a special catalog, which soon will be available in all the countries, um, which is exactly that one. So if you download the catalog, if you ask uh, to uh, your local dealer or to our distributor all over the world, if you contact us, we can share with you this catalog and give you all the information for what we have uh, uh, available for, uh, for your audio system. Uh, you can uh, see all the measures, all the details, or the dimensions, finishes, uh, uh, as well prices. Um, here are not mentioned because uh, uh, prices may vary, may, might change, may change uh, from country to country. Uh, so consider to to have a focus uh, or, or to check uh, on that. But I wanted to show you these uh, three pictures because these pictures for the HF Elite Series, which is again the HF uh, series dedicated to the Benier Wood uh, uh, Shalves, again in American Natural Walnut, Indian Rosewood and Indonesian Ebony Macassar with gloss transparent. Uh, I wanted to show these pictures because uh, you can mm, easily understand the different solution of uh, uh, wood that we selected for our uh, racks. Uh, they are a bit more expensive than the HF traditional uh, racks because of uh, the banier wood and the timber. Uh, so if you are interested, we are always uh, at your disposal, available. Um, I wanted to uh, show you as uh, uh, last, uh, last uh, um, option, um, a nice tool that is giving us a uh, huge satisfaction. Uh, we call it configurator uh, and uh, it is a, um, a very useful, um, configurator for your audio video uh, equipment and setup because uh, you can contact us uh, easily. Uh, it is a free of charge consultant service. You can specify from which country you are texting us. Uh, and uh, it's easy because uh, you have to mention your available space in your music room with depth centimeters or uh, inches. And only to mention uh, brand and model name of the components you have at home, or also of those components you're going to purchase in the future. If you want to give us further details with some notes, it will be extremely helpful in some cases. And uh, yes, you can express if you have standard budget or a low one, and uh, we will be back to you uh, within 24 hours. Uh, giving uh, uh, the best suggestions, um, even even multiple suggestions for uh, for your equipment. So uh, feel free to to contact us uh, if you want to spend ten minutes uh, uh, letting us uh, uh, do something for you. Uh, we are we will be happy, uh, and it is extremely good because, uh, for example, if you are making a UK a configurator request from UK, uh, when we will reply, we will directly uh, put uh, on uh, email, on CC, on the email, uh, me and audio distribution, which is our UK distributor. And uh, we will give you a technical and sales support with uh, um, no, no, no problem, no? And so uh, feel free to contact us. Um, once again, uh, I would like to say huge thanks for uh, spending some uh, good time with me tonight. Um, I, I will be back to you 
very soon I, I just want to give you um, the last uh, uh, the last uh, suggestion because uh, if you give me one second um, Marco Fullone which is uh, our brand ambassador um, made for us uh, a fantastic a fantastic uh, uh, playlist a fantastic selection of uh, music uh, Marco is working uh, for Radio Monte Carlo, which is uh, one of the most famous uh, uh, radio stations uh, in Italy and probably in Europe. And uh, I want to give you uh, this, uh, this lead because uh, uh, it's a fantastic selection of music, are 30 songs. Uh, and uh, just give me one second because I want to to give you the, the direct link. So here it is. Um, if you have Spotify, uh, you can explore this fantastic uh, uh, playlist. Uh, I, I also enlarge the screen. So this is uh, our Today, this is our uh, music suggestion because Marco did for us uh, a fantastic uh, uh, job. And uh, really, um, if you have time, follow this, uh, this playlist, which is Solid Steel by Marco Fullone, two hours and 22 minutes of uh, amazing music. And uh, uh, discover some new music suggestions uh, and let us know, okay? The, the playlist will be monthly up, uh, updated. So uh, it is only the beginning, we are just starting. And uh, believe me that you, you will love it because uh, there's uh, a lot of jazz music, uh, pop funk, uh, both female and male artists and uh, yes, you will see that uh, some of these beautiful songs will be also available uh, on Qubits, uh, on Tidal for IRS resolution because I always tell Spotify is not the ideal, it's not iFi, it's not um, the ideal solution for your uh, audio system because it's uh, um, um, they are these tracks are um, MP3s, no? So compressed music, so. Um, so Andy, Andy knows the playlist very well because I remember, uh, and also Jay, if I'm not wrong, they, they reported me that they listened to it. And uh, believe me, uh, it is a fantastic selection. So once again, I want to say thank you so much for spending time with me. Uh, we will meet again. Uh, uh, on next week uh, with some more um, surprises uh, because we are experiencing new ways uh, of uh, giving you original new contents uh, on our live boxes. And I wish you all the best with your music, uh, with your audio equipment, with your family, with your friends, uh, uh, with your lover, uh, everything which is uh, good and positive, okay? Uh, thanks again. Grazie mille. Uh, I want to say thank you to all the Italian uh, um, supporters who, who saw actually uh, this live box. Uh, I want to say uh, that uh, thank you in all the, all the ways, everywhere in the world, and uh, have fun with your music. Ciao and thank you. A presto. Bye.